Hey y'all, I am coming on to do a layout to play along with Mercy Tierra kits. I have the July 2023 kit called Summer Vibes. I've got the pattern paper kit. I have got the, the cardstock add-on and the embellishment kit. Like guys, look at all of this paper and I've already done a layout. But I do also want to play along with the sketch challenge. And this sketch is from Christine Davidson. And it looks so darn fun. Look, I have to clean my printer. Anyway, so I printed out the sketch. So I would just have it handy dandy next to me. And it's a fab sketch. So we've got a background, right? I'll probably go ahead and mat it. Um, really nice large block here. Strip here. And... That's an interesting idea, that strip. And then we've got these fishtail banners. Photo can go this way, this way. You can have however many photos you want. And then a really nice embellishment cluster. Oh, title. Boom. Just like that. So I thought that would be fun. So right now I'm thinking, do I want to use this photo? This is myself and the hubs. And we were in a town in northern Michigan. That's so cool. So back here is a big dam and like the rapids are coming so strong and the water goes this way and then it flows and goes into Lake Michigan. Very nice, huh? And this was taken just last month. So it's pretty darn current. So what I need to find is what papers I want to use. So background. Oh, and I will go ahead. I've got a piece somewhere in here, right here, <laughs> of white cardstock and I'll map my photo with that. And this is a textured white. It is a fab. It is just basil white. So that part's easy, right? But let me get, guys, I have so many gorgeous embellishments that go with this. It's going to be super fun. So I've got like just, just like nonstop scraps and fun stuff. So the last layout I did, I really concentrated on the simple story stuff because I thought, you know, it's so darn fun. Then we've got Chamel going on. Oh, guys, I, I have got to figure this out. Okay, I'm going to get my stuff together, pick out all of my papers for this, and I'll meet you right back. So I've narrowed down a few things, and I thought I would show you. And then I'll sign off for just a little bit because I have all of this cutting to do. We've got these great fishtail banners, this piece. I have things. Might grab some of my punches. It just depends. I'm not sure what I want to do for that really fun block right there. So I've got this Cartabella Happy Crafting piece called Happy Floral, and I'm going to use that for my mat. And then this is Pink Fresh Studio Sunshine on My Mind Sun and Sand. And guys, look at that summer agenda. Absolutely perfect. So I'll cut it here and here. Great. And of course, I will gut this piece out and use some of that for my banner. Then, oh, but wait. <laughs> I love this pale blue as well. It is called Happy Place. And that's from Taurus Mode for some of my banner piece. Oh, I thought I would do that for that really large block. That's what I was going to do there. And then more. I have Tutu Pink. And I liked bringing that in because I really want to use this piece. And this is called Lazy Days. So that's how I feel my palette's gonna go. So I'm gonna have some of the deeper blue and some of this lighter blue. And my puppy named Blue was just grabbing something. I don't know what he was doing. So I need to spend a little bit of time getting all of that organized out. And I'll meet you right back here. So I've got some really nice traction. I did end up doing a double mat for my layout because I love all of these patterns so much. So why not use them? And they're both gutted, absolutely gutted. And that's fine. Uh, this strip right here was just an off cut. It was from trimming something. So I'm going to have that be this piece. And let's see, what else do I have going on? And so these pieces are stuck down. And then my three little fishtail banner pieces, I'm going to just fit on, you know, kind of, as I always call it, just kind of willy-nilly. Oh, I'm losing some of this deep blue. And I don't want to lose all of that. So I'm going to cut it in half and spread it out because it totally gets um, it totally gets covered by one of those tall banners. So I'm going to spread it out just a little tiny bit more. Then my photo, once I get those banners on, 
I'll decide which order I want to go ahead and back this photo with all kinds of scraps. And then everything is scuffed up too. So I've got all of these pieces down. This is matted. My photo's all matted and it's popped up on some foam that you can see in there. So that is great. I also pulled our alphas and I have my title Fishtown, Leland, Michigan. So Fishtown's in Leland, Michigan. Leland's just the name of a city, but this little area is called Fishtown because it is, if you look in this photo, this is a dock and it was a fishing village back in the day. Now it's just kind of touristy, although there is, there are still some fishing uh, vessels there. Super cool. Now, if we look at our sketch, my title will go here and I originally had my photo lower and I popped it up more because my title is gonna be like a two part. So that's cool. And then we've got this bit here. So I know that I wanted to use the florals that we have because florals may be my fave. So I know I'm gonna put them here. I already know they're gonna end up going like that. I just know how I roll. So that's gonna end up happening. So I'm gonna try to do it here. It's gonna ooze a little bit. We'll have our title here. And then depending on how I'm feeling, I may have an itty bitty cluster here. I'm just gonna see how that vibes for me. But I'm gonna get out some of these florals and start drooling on them a little bit. Let me put my title, very cool, um, up here a little bit. Oh, and I also, you know how we've got that little shimmer packet? Well, I went ahead and pulled out the frame that was right here in the cardstock stickers and just made a cute little shaker really quickly with that. So that was super fun. I do shakers a lot. I haven't done one on camera in the last month and people end up asking me. So going forward, I'll, I, I forgot that I need to start doing them on camera again, but that's just a sticker and it turned into a shaker so incredibly quickly. So that can be part of both my title and that floral cluster area. So I'm just gonna pull out some florals and start arranging them. Um, I don't like to do too much of that on camera because I can faff around forever with that. Now I also know I'll want to pop it up. So what if we have something kind of like that, right? And when I say I know I'll bring something up here, it would be kind of like a smaller kind of a cluster. I just said I'm not going to do it on camera. You know what I'm doing, everyone? Doing it on camera. So something kind of like that. Uh, love, 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 love the blue in this collection, as you can tell from this layout, because I'm just going off with the blue. Um, I like that blue there. So why don't I just bring a little bit more of the blue with the leafy bits? And this may be enough of those florals for me right here. Um, this yellow is quite frankly, the bee's knees. So I might be coming over here with that while still being able to see a little bit of my sequiny joy. Okay, I wanna get these pieces down with my title. Um, popping them all up on foam. And I'll meet you right back here. So I am pretty darn excited with how this is going on. So in my opinion, actually now I don't need anything over here. You know how we were just talking about that? Because I have stuff coming all the way down here. So I have this whole diagonal thing going on. So in my opinion, at this point, I can put the sketch away. Now we had circles here. Use whatever you have. If you wanna do circles, it is a fab sketch. It's a keeper sketch, right? Go ahead and do that, but if not, use what you have in your product and it will totally, totally come together. So at this point, all I have to do, I know I'm gonna bring in some more of my sparkly bits because I have it here in my shaker. And anytime I have something in a cute little shaker, I wanna sprinkle it along. But that will be my last thing to do. I want to go ahead and look in these other like little bits from Pink Fresh and see what I can tuck in, what I can help to tell more of my story, all of that kind of stuff. I even have this cute little bit that I'm gonna look through. It's a crafting thing, but guys, look, there's florals and everything on here. So there's always something you can find. Like the word cute is bringing out that navy that I like so much. So hey, who even knows? I may be able to find something and there that I like. Guys, look at this one right here, because my husband is this one for me. How 
cute. So you just never know. Look at all of the things in the products that you have handy dandy for sure. I'm going to do like the process of elimination. Does anything on here work to help tell my story? I'm wearing sunglasses that are about the right color. And there was a pair of sunglasses on here, but I gave them to my daughter and she put them on her cell phone. But that totally would have worked because we're both wearing sunnies, right? So just go through all your goodies, layer it all up and have yourself a time. We also have, I'm gonna look at these. Did you guys see this cute little fruity mix that came in the embellishment goodies? They are adorable. So anywho, I'm going to spend a little bit of time, tuck, 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 tuck. Then I will come back and show you where we are. So far, I just stuck in this little sticker that looks like a ticket and this one. So this one said June 6th. We did go in June and this one says summer. So absolutely perfect to continue telling our story. And I'm thinking a nice little floral coming off of that. The 6th isn't important. We weren't there on the 6th. And then... Maybe one of these puffies up here as well, because it's always fun to mimic what you do from one side to the other. And you get that different texture, which I love doing. So let's see. Oh, let's see. Oh, and I also put this Let's Get Away Just You and Me because he and I went so low. Those little sunnies are kind of cute. They could be eyeglasses as well, though. I'm wondering. They're kind of big for what I have going here, but I might just go ahead and do a little tuckage right here where you see them there, but it's not the main thing. Okay, I do have to get some sequins on here and I might put some white splatty bits, guys, but that is gonna be it. So let me show you where we are with it. Just gonna pop a few sequins on, like I said, and then, um, yeah little bit of some white splatters and this whole thing will be complete so i'm super excited about it cannot wait to keep creating with this kit i'm gonna have links down below for the facebook group and the website and is there anything else i don't think so so still shots to follow guys thank you so much for watching and i'll be back ever so soon with another video